How's it going, everyone? G Smith 624 here. And before you continue in this video, fair warning, there will be lots of tits. This is your warning. This is a very skimpy mod. Very, very lewd armor. What this armor is, you may be asking? This is the new Miller Vampire Chain Curus mod. This is the Sephiram version. However, there is UN, UNBP, I believe it's UN something, something like that. There is another version of the mod, not for, this is for this body type alone, the Seraphim body type, which is the body type I use in my mods, but if you don't want to use that body type and you use the other body types, there is a different mod for you to download, it's the UNNP version, link will be in the description as long, as well with the Sephiram version. Sephiram version will be on top. Anyways, warnings out of the way. Look at these goddamn titties. Look at this outfit. Look at it. Fucking. Look at it. It's not an outfit. It doesn't exist. This is not close. I refuse to tell. I refuse for Did you, you to tell me. Talk? I refuse. I refuse for you to say those are close. It's not close. Look at it. With those jiggle physics, that, that's not close. Although, <laughs> but in order to get these close, quotation marks, you come to a blacksmith forge, you will need leather, gold, and precious emeralds, rubies, sapphires, amethyst, all sorts of those different things. Because they'll be in two different categories. To get the basic armor itself, you'll need to go into the leather, scroll down until you get to the chain boots. You'll get, you'll see this picture here that tells you you are in the right place for the mod. There are different versions of the mod. There's copper and black, and uh, copper, green, copper, white, copper, blue, or go, excuse me, not copper, blue, gold and blue, red and blue, iron and red, steel and black, and copper, black, copper, green, copper, white. Yeah, there's, there's lots of colors. That's the point here. There's lots of different colors for you to go to. But the boots require leather and leather strips. Too, pretty easy. The main chest piece. That's where it gets a little more complicated. You need vampire dust, and depending on which version of it you are building, you will need a certain type of rare gem. For the black, white, red, and for some strange reason, not the iron and red, but the golden red, you will need rubies. For the copper green, actually that's the only one. For the copper green, you will need emeralds. And then for the golden blue and iron and red, for some reason, you will need sapphires. So, you need those gems. And then, more leather strips and leather. And then, to get the wings and the hat, you go to jewelry. And there is multiple versions of everything. Full iron blue, full gold and red, full. And there's also simple versions, along with the full. But you will need gold ingots lots of gold ingots and rubies and sapphires depending on which ones you are building and then same with the wings you will need fucking leather emerald or fucking gold you you'll need either dwemer ingots or gold along with sapphires emeralds or rubies depends on which once again which version you're building i went with the gold and blue which cost me gold sapphire and leather for the most part and here's the final product. God damn, this is not real Did clothes. I, all the combat records yet? I don't I don't care what you say to me. Double check. These are not real clothes. And also, one other thing I want to point out, if you go with the Seraphim version, there is two versions of that as well. There's the TBBP version of it, which includes jiggle physics! Look at those cities jiggle. There is some slight clipping still, but even then, it's it's a small hey, price to pay to have this beautiful Dragon outfit. Please? So, if you want the mod for yourself, link will be in the description below. And bless your soul. May you have the lewdest Skyrim you've ever wanted. Farewell, everyone. I've been your host, G Smith 624 and I hope to see you all in the next episode.